my youtube channel and today we are going to see about how to fix windows could not start the vtc service and local computer error one incorrect function before getting into the video make sure you have hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss the upcoming videos so vg service prevents cheating and hacking in online multiplayer game by detecting and blocking unauthorized software and modification it is uh, vgc service has nothing with the windows os but it you need which is service to run the game correctly however sometimes you need to help to need help to start the vgc service on your computer and you will get an error message when you attempt to begin the vgc service windows could not start the vgc service and local computer error one incorrect function so the reasons are windows could not start the vgc service means there is an issue with the file in the riot wag node which blocks you from the launching the service so let's see the fix enable the vgc service vanguard relies on the service called vgc to run correctly so if the vgc service stops working and crashes you will get error code 1 on the screen one of the first solution to try is to restart the vgc service go to the windows search box and type services double click on the service tab to launch it find and locate vgc service in the list of services right click on the vgc service and click on properties click on startup type and it is automatic check this uh, check the status column to make sure it is running if not correct click on the widget service and click on start see if you can start the widget service and the error is gone if not repair the cache file run system file checker the system file checker is an utility in windows that allows users to scan for corruptions in windows system file and restore the corrupted file so type cmd in the search bar and right click on it to run as administrator in the current uh, in the command uh, prompt type sfc space slash scan now and hit enter then the sf uh, the sfc tool will uh, start scanning all the protected systems files on your computer and replace the corrupted ones with the cached copy located in the compressed folder restart your computer once the scan is completed solution number 3 and in the riot vanguard as discussed earlier the vg service has nothing to do with the windows file it is a background service related to riot vanguard type add or remove program in the windows search bar double click on add or remove program option from the list find and locate riot vanguard right click on it and click on uninstall wait till the process to complete and restart your system now try to restart vgc service again and you can start it without any other solution number four stopping all other services free up this space and ram and boost performance a clear boot a clean boot starts windows with a minimal set of drivers and startup programs so that you can determine whether a background program is interfering with your pro game or the program so in the windows search box type ms config select system configuration from the list and double click on it and the service tab of system configuration hide all microsoft services click disable and tap on apply click ok and close the system configuration application now open task manager by pressing the ctrl plus shift plus escape button disable all the startup items and close the task manager now check the vgc service in the services application and try to uh, try to restart if it is on stop status if it is running fine there is some other services called with the vgc vgc service and also uninstall if you have any other antivirus software installed you can check the guide here on how to identify and stop the conflict of service how to understand uh, which file uh, conflict with the vgc service so you can go through the step and follow it one by one uh, to identify the conflicted program so solution number five set the vgc service to restart automatically if none of the above method work repeat the below steps whenever error occurs right click on vgc service and click on property click on recovery tab from the properties window change the first failure and subsequent failure to restart the service and click on apply now start vgc keep the service window open and run world rent as admin now you can uh, run start the vgc service without any error i hope you found this video useful to don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss such videos thank you